Who's working on the weekend? We are attorneys Alexander and Catalano. Call right now if you need help. Oh yeah, thanks for the coffee. The heavy hitters are all you need. Call 1-800-LAW-1333. Hey everybody, welcome back to Today in Central New York. Pete asked me to stretch for him a little bit, I think, because what? he had to maybe fix his hairdo. Well, yeah, I mean, look, I, there's a lot that goes into keeping hair <laughs> looking so gorgeous. So rad. Looking great, yeah, Pete. Referring to, to this, by the way. That, that, this. <laughs> this is a look for you. I think, think we should, think go, I should go with this permanently? You should. I really, really think you should. All right. I am wearing deodorant, by the way, in case well, you're curious. Well, thank goodness. Um, <laughs> <laughs> let's have a look at the temperatures. We're in the upper 20s, the lower 30s. There should be kind of a haze if you're wearing these type of glasses, man. It's totally far out. Gonna have a nice looking day today, although chilly. 20s and 30s is exactly the kind of normal weather you get early in the morning on the last day of October. In terms of how it feels all day, we have bright sunshine. It gets a little filtered behind thickening clouds this afternoon, although I think we'll stay dry all the way through trick or treat time, except when we get towards the trick or treat time, there are going to be some thickening clouds at that point. But overall, if there's going to be a shower tonight and there's only like a 20% chance we get it, it's likely more likely than not going to be after trick or treat time is over with. And we're going to play with some extra clouds early tomorrow morning too. Early in the morning, we start with clouds. <laughs> you like this part when I do this? I can't stop laughing. Is it the curls or there's the swaying? <laughs> Uh, the clouds giving way to increasing sunshine. There's actually another coastal system that may give a little rain or snow to the immediate coast tomorrow, but this will not affect us. We actually have a very, very peaceful weather pattern coming up for the next seven days. I'm serious. I'm not making that up because it's one of those peace love things. It's actually quiet. We have just a 20% chance of a sprinkle today, and maybe this little thing comes a little closer by Thursday morning. Maybe we'll get some extra clouds and thickening clouds give us a shower in the afternoon. But overall, considering it is the first week of November coming up here starting tomorrow, we don't have any major downturn in temperatures. No major warm ups either, but I think we'll get into the 60s. Cool, man. 60s are the best. 60s uh, on Wednesday. Don't forget, we set the clocks back this coming weekend, so we gain an extra hour, although the sunrise and sunset both up. We're going down earlier by one hour as well. We go from daylight saving time to Eastern Standard Time. Somebody it, in here oh. thinks you look like Shaggy from Scooby-Doo. Yeah, <laughs> I got the Jim Morrison thing a little bit. I, <laughs> what else do we got? Uh, uh, Howard Stern, what else do we have here? Oh my goodness, the Geico Caveman. Oh, the Geico Caveman, yeah, but then I have to have more facial hair, <laughs> I think so. Oh, goodness. Oh, Neanderthal. Uh, interactive <laughs> Doppler radar on our website. Don't forget to take a look at the Facebook page. Be a part of the discussion. Tell me what you think about my outfit. I can take it. Megan? I love it. I love it. I love it. Pete, thank you so much.